Disruptor has been destroyed, and Kerrigan has regained control of her minions. I fear that she will forget our pact and turn on us. I know what you mean, Phoenix. I'd love to believe that she's on the level, but there's a part of me that just knows better. However, I do believe that she's serious about taking out the UED. The only real question left is what happens to us when she wins. If you ask me, she's completely untrustworthy. But so long as she'll help me retake Core Hall, I'll work with her. Shut up, Arcturus. If I wanted your damn opinion, I would have beaten it out of you, in case you forgot. You were the reason she became what she is in the first place. You boys should really learn to play nice with each other. Kerrigan, are your forces ready to assault Core Hall as we planned? Nearly. I still need a substantial cache of resources in order to build up my primary hive clusters. I'm wondering if you gentlemen wouldn't mind going on a fuel raid for me. It sounds like you've already got a plan. What are you thinking? I'm thinking that we should pay the Kalmorian Combine a little visit. Moria is one of the largest resource nodes in the sector. If you can bypass their defenses and steal enough resources from them, we'll be able to afford a full-scale assault on Korhal. It's risky. But I think we can handle it. Phoenix, are you into this? If it betters our chances, I will lead the assault myself. Great. Let's get moving. Do you think they suspect anything, my queen? Of course. They aren't stupid, Duran. They're siding with the evil they know over the evil they don't. They simply don't yet realize what it will cost them. Okay. Now... The last... Cerebrit, I want you to infest as many Terran command centers as possible. Once they're infested, we'll be able to use them in our coming assault on Korhal. Now I will actually invest some command centers. I'm s I don't know if I'll infest every command center, but I'll try to infest as many as possible. Also, gotta say, I really am not fond of the slow movement speed of the um, overlords. I mean, that's why. I, I mean, obviously, that's why I get that one upgrade that increases their movement speed. Now, I haven't played this since I was like this mission since I was like ten, and I remember it being really hard. It is difficult to believe that I am working alongside my greatest enemy in order to save this sector. Fortune has been whimsical of late. You sound like a tired old man, Phoenix. Don't let the fact that I am 368 years older than you tell your impression of me, young Raider. I can still, how do you dare say it, throw down with the best of them. I stand corrected. <laughs> So, obviously, First Order business. Build up forces and destroy shit. But first, I need to obviously build the hatchery and do the same old strategy I've been doing. But yeah, last time I played this mission, I was 10, and, uh... I think I had literally only Phoenix left, because I sucked at strategy. Okay, I'm gonna improve the games, or increase game speed for right now, because this is way too boring. Never 
Saga, we need at least 10,000 units of crystals to maintain the hive clusters. Don't come back with anything less. Yep. Now I could just cheat and type in, uh, show me the money for those resources. But I clearly won't because that, uh, that's not really fair. Now I could, uh, or, yeah. Now let's see. I can just get all the minerals I need right from that little encampment there. That was so successful. Anyway, um, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to actually conquer and destroy everybody. Now let's see, what can I build? Oh, I can fill defilers and nidus canals. Good, good, good. I may be able to build guardians and devourers already. I actually don't know offhand if I can. So I don't prepare for any of these segments, I just go into them. Last one was an exception, because that wasn't really my fault. <clears throat> so I'm going to have to spawn more overlords pretty soon. I do remember for a fact that the Terrans will send uh, nukes. And I believe they send cloak wraiths. colony here just to uh tent cloak or uh counter any cloaked wraiths that may or may not be in the area. I think I remember th I think they sent cloaked wraiths. Hey that Uh oh. Already sending in the tanks, huh? or something to counter the tanks because they definitely have longer range than uh, sunken colonies obviously. And they just decimate every uh, ground unit except for the 
except for the ultralisks, which are expensive and slow to reproduce. And even then, they're pretty, uh, pretty effective against them. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna have another one because I need two spires, one for one kind of upgrade, one for the other. And then I th guess I may actually start, uh, I guess I may actually start, uh, Start building up and or build another uh, hatchery over here. And even though I probably won't be using ultra or zerglings, or at least not very many of them. Uh, let's see, hydralis ten. That's fine. Okay. Spire, Spire, Queen's Nest, and I will build an Ultralisk Cavern if I should so want Ultralisks. I don't know if I will or not yet. And boom, Overlords, faster Overlord movement. Oh, that already. Probably a really fucking stupid idea. I'm gonna save actually. There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's not gonna work. Phoenix is too, uh, I wouldn't say he's too weak, but he definitely ain't tanky enough to tank all that. If I can get a greater Spire, there is actually a good chance that I can build, uh, Guardians, at least. It's like that was the main reason for you. That's one of the main reasons I get hives at all. You get the hell out of here. I hear that. Okay. I wish I could build at least a shield battery to sustain his health a little bit. Um, now, what did I build you for again?
Oh, I can get a guardian. Okay, good. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if even this will work. gas gathering too. Okay. Well, those rates aren't cloaking yet. Oh wait, actually I think they are. Yep. That's exact. Wait, I heard the unloading sound. Where? 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 Make sure it's not my own unit somehow being loaded into something. I did hear it. I know this base here is pretty weak, or at least I remember it being pretty weak, so I wonder if I can at least take it out and nothing else. Uh, do I have the... okay. I see at least a mineral field up here. Ah, 
not get back. Well, fuck that. Actually, where's that drone that I had set aside? Okay. No, I'm not going to accept that loss. I, re I, I refuse to accept that. iffy on hell. in there. Oh no, not you guys. There. So far, yeah, this has proven to be a bit tricky. I build here? Huh? Can I build there or not? 
Okay. If Motherfucker. Get. Oh, come on. Get in there. Go. Oh. You. Infest it. Yay. This Kilmorian Combine continues to operate while the UET grips the Dominion with an iron fist. I'll never underestimate the motivational effects of Terran Green again.
Now I'm gonna get a bunch of Hydralisks. Reason for the Hydralisks is so they can attack Wraiths or Battle Cruisers. But point is air units that can threaten the the ability of the the guardians to just wreak havoc upon it wreak havoc upon everything that moves on the ground. Okay, that's... Actually, I'm gonna make that group three. No, I want I want two groups of guardians. I decided. Oh, son of a bitch! I wondered when I was gonna have to do that. Am I going to be allowed to actually place this here? Or will the game arbitrarily say no? No one actually did let me that time. If anyone wants to explain why it wouldn't work the last time, feel free to tell me. Unfortunately, once, once again, I am totally out of resources, or at least out of gas. Oh, Phoenix. Actually, where there's that group, there'll be more of them, I'm certain. I just wrong. Luckily, these wraiths don't cloak, or they don't seem to, to seem to. Holy shit!
That could have been bad. and multitask which I admit makes for some dull commentary but sorry that's what happens when you try to win all right so you guys are now idle idle no more guys just work on that one if you're going to work on anything. Alright, so... Actually, you just go over there. Two groups of hydralisks, two groups of guardians, and a couple of uh, uh, overlords just for uh, cloak detection. I'm actually running low. And you guys are group five. Alright, group four. I'm gonna save. Just in case the sneaky little bastards have a nuke ready for me.
Uh oh. Back. sure where that tank was, unless I destroyed it. If I destroyed it, then no complaints. Uh, where's that queen? Queen? Uh, fuck, where is it? Instead of focusing on that, I'll just... Fall back. There's way too many tanks around. Okay. There you are. You can cloak all you want, boys. I can still see you. Aha. I prefer large scale battles over these covert missions. My heart longs for the epic struggles of my youth. To go into battle alongside my Protoss brethren again. Ah, uh, but it's time to tell all the things. Haha. <laughs> I lost a bunch of Hydralisks, unfortunately, but I kind of expected to lose them because they are not exactly the most, uh... They're not exactly the toughest units out there. So, so far, I haven't had a single nuke warning. Now that I've said that, we're gonna get like a million of them, probably. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, hello. I think I found my next... I think I found my next victims to overwhelm. I thought I had not gotten the, uh, site upgrade yet, but apparently I did, so it's all good. Not good for the enemy, that's for sure. Oh, there's blue. I haven't seen you around.
Fuck. Damn science vessels. Where is this one overboard? I didn't expect there'd be a radiate everywhere. Fuck, I lost my entire army basically because of that. I didn't expect there'd be so many damn, uh. I didn't expect there'd be so many damn irradiate units. There we go. Science vessels, that's what they're fucking called. Apparently, irradiate costs like no energy whatsoever. They just kept spamming and spamming and spamming the shit out of it. Alright. this again. I managed to get a little bit of offense.
Unfortunately, I lost some units already, and I'm not even there yet. Okay, fucking... I destroyed it. I'm almost done. Actually, I don't see how I couldn't be because... Stop running all around the map. Now find the bastard siege tank and kill it. Try to infest that, but fuck it. I don't care. The only difference that it makes is that, uh, 
a couple of the command centers come with you. As, actually, as I'll show off right here. Oh, okay. I still got three of them, so. So I'll just load this file so I actually have them. Actually, real quick, I wonder, do I keep those if I just go into into this and do this? No, I don't. Okay, so I'll just load the file and have that. So I'll see you guys next time.